gone but not forgotten. Today, Nebraska paid tribute to more than 20 fallen officers. It's part of National Police Week. Reporter John Madden was at the ceremony and spoke to a widow who calls this a sad but necessary day. Certain sounds or songs can bring back memories. The worst is Amazing Grace. They played that at his memorial too. And uh, it just brings back a lot of memories and it's just, it's hard, but this meant a lot. It was an emotional day for Kathy Kranz, who lost her husband of 29 years in April. Well, he was my life and I'll never forget him. I'm sure there are a lot of people that will never forget him. James Kranz, who spent 25 years as an investigator for the Nebraska State Patrol, died from organ failure. As Kathy and a few of his friends honored his life Wednesday. I think he would have appreciated it. Um, you know, he loved being a, a cop, and I think he would have been very proud. And James wasn't the only Nebraskan honored. 23 roses were placed on this wreath to remember 23 members of law enforcement who passed away within the year. As those attending the event say, never forgetting them is always important. It, but it's just a day to reflect on uh, what we do uh, in the community and those that, uh, that have made that sacrifice in the performance of those duties. A local ceremony during a national week-long event recognizing current or retired members of law enforcement who either passed away in the line of duty or from natural causes helped carry on their legacy. Because what we do is, is, is sacrifice and it's important that we don't forget the sacrifices that those who put the badge on that they make and uh, this kind of event uh, holds that up. More than 160 members of law enforcement nationwide were killed in the line of duty last year. It's a dangerous profession. Uh, when, you, when you sign up for this, you recognize that you may have to pay that price at some point. It's never easy dealing with death no matter how it happens, as this day was tough but important for people like Kathy. It was an honor to him and an honor to all of those that have fallen. Fallen but not forgotten. In Omaha, John Madden, 3 News Now. Another service will be held in Grand Island on Friday. Cheyenne County Sheriff's Deputy Jailer Randy Haddock's his name will be added to a memorial. Haddock's died of a heart attack while on duty back in July.